everybody, it's the War Hipster here, coming at you with another Contrast Plus painting tutorial. And today we are painting another Termagant in another High Fleet from the Leviathan box sent to me only by Games Workshop. And so a massive thank you to them for that, because now we get to do a High Fleet Jormungander tutorial. Yes, this is a very, very cool scheme. It's very, very simple. So what we're going to do is we're going to start off now by taking some Black Legion and our model has been primed in Wraithbone. And we're going to take the Black Legion and we're going to apply this over the top of all of his skin. And what we're going to try and do is avoid any of the kind of large splits in the skin. And we're also going to avoid any of the kind of chitinous armour and the hooves and things like that because they're going to be a different colour. But otherwise, we're just going to get this Black Legion all over. And then once that's done, we'll come back. So with all of that Black Legion now applied, what we're going to do is we're going to take some Flesh Terrors Red and we're going to apply this to those gaps in all of the skin. Like that. And we're also going to apply this over the top of the claws and the hooves and things like that. So with that now done, what we're going to do is we're going to take some Iron Jaws Yellow. We're going to apply this over the top of all of the carapace. So with that Iron Jaws Yellow all applied, we're then going to take some Cassandra Yellow and apply this over the top as a shade. So with that now done, we're going to take some Volupus Pink and we're going to apply this over the top of the teeth and the tongue. So for our final base coat, we're going to take some warp lightning. I'm going to apply this over the top of the eye. Like that. So with that now done, what we're going to do is we're going to take some Drakenhof Nightshade and we're going to apply this over the top of the black skin but not over the top of the gun.
And with that now done, we're going to take some Caraberg Crimson. We're going to use this to shade all the red. So with that done, our High Fleet Jormungander Termagant is now what I would call a war hipster battle ready. He's looking pretty cool. However, we're not going to leave him there. No, of course we're not. We're going to take him to the next level. We're going to do this by adding some highlights. And the first one we're going to add is some thinned down Dark Reaper. And we're going to use this to highlight all of his skin and the gun. Now with all of that Dark Reaper applied, we're then going to take some Thunderhawk Blue. We're going to apply this to the sharpest points. In all the black. So with that all done, the black is now finished. So what we're going to do is we're going to take some thin down Screaming Skull. And we're going to use this to do two things. One is we're going to use this to pick out the teeth. Like that. And then what we're also going to do with the screaming skull is we're going to use this to highlight all of the yellow chitinous armor. So with all of that done, the armor is finished. So what we're going to do is going to take some Gorse Blaster Green and we're going to apply this over the top of his eyes. So with that done, we're going to finish things off by taking some thinned down Evil Sun Scarlet and using this to highlight all the red. So here we have it then, High Fleet Jormungander all done it's really really quick and simple this one merely yellow black pink and red can't ask for better than that can you and again all of these schemes absolutely build out across the rest of the range it's very very simple i really like this in terms of the compatibility of tyranids you can always add extra colors in and add a little bit more red here or there or even add some stripes or something if you really want to just to break up that yellow a bit it's awesome if you enjoyed this video, you love the channel, and you'd like to support me further, you absolutely can do so. Head to patreon.com forward slash warhipster, just like these bosses have done scrolling up on the screen before you, whose continued support helps me continue to make all the wonderful content that you enjoy.
Alternatively, you could become a YouTube channel member by clicking on the join button on the channel page or just below this video like these wonderful, amazing people have done. And if you really like this video and you just want to shoot me a little thanks, you can click on the thanks button just below this video. Don't forget to share it, like it, comment on it, and don't forget to subscribe to the channel. And to make sure you stay up to date, don't forget to click the bell icon. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you all very soon in the next one. Happy Wargaming.